take three for this install and right now I'm just going to refresh it I'm getting ready to head out and but before I do I want to go ahead and refresh it make it juicy and make it look you know almost good as new so I just want to show you my edges and then the back how that is looking which honestly is not really bad it's not bad at all um, but I had to give myself a pat on the back because typically when I have twists I never just wear them down I put them in different styles and stuff and um, you know have them up all over the place just different hairdos and wraps this time I just been wearing it like this no bobbles no barrettes no stones and jewels none of that so what I'm gonna start off with first is I'm going to oil my scalp with the melanin multi-purpose pure oil blend and I'm just gonna go wherever I feel a part or scalp and this can be used on the scalp and the hair but I'm starting with the scalp first now if this was bedtime I would first spray my hair and scalp down with my herbal hair tea my DIY herbal hair tea since I'm getting ready to leave I don't want to put anything wet you know like watery on my hair so but it works wonders when you do it overnight and tie your hair up so let me just do this quickly Ooh, feels so good also at night I would take the time and do a scalp massage either with the pads of my fingers or I would use one of those massagers I don't have it out I would use one of those massagers that um, vibrate you know the ones that they have all over the YouTube streets I'm really enjoying keeping my hair twisted like this the only thing about this hair though it's hot it's not even hot outside yet and I'm like oh I don't know if I'll be able to maintain this uh, for the summer months alright the next thing I'm gonna do is for my I'm gonna follow up with the melanin curl cream I think this is the Mel melanin twist elongating style cream I'm using this as a moisturizer slash sort of a leave-in type of situation emulsify it and I'm just gonna go down the length of the hair not to put it on the scalp not putting it on my scalp and then I'll do this to separate any hairs because you know Marley hair could have that it'll start to love up on itself just like regular natural hair and you'll have like the different strands coming out sometimes I will use a leave-in conditioner right here and then I would um, go over it with this it's not always necessary especially if you're doing it regularly this is how I'm able to treat my hair and care for my hair while it's in the twists and then I just go through like this and then I have the back section to do and I like to squeeze it and then go th down through it like this and doing the best I can to cover everything so maybe a little bit up here at the top and I put a little bit more oil on the actual hair next I'm going in with the TGIN Miracle Repair Anti-Breakage and I'm only going to do this where I think my hair ends at the bottom. 
So this is only for the ends of my hair. It smells so good. And then I'm going to do the next. Sometimes my hair is like extra juicy. <laughs> And which I love it like before bedtime when it's extra juicy. I just love it. I think a little piece got in there. That's good enough. One more. Just make sure you have enough. This is for my actual hair at the ends. Okay, and then finally for the length of the braids, well not finally, but I'm putting the braid sheen. It doesn't matter what kind. And instead of spraying the whole braid, I'm just going to go section by section. All the way to the ends because this is for the actual synthetic hair and then this side all the way to the ends and then I'm going to use the I need the mirror for this but a lot of times I will take some gel and I will rub it down the length of all of the hair just to make it lay down I don't want to do a lot of this gel okay just to make it lay down to catch any flyaways about like that much and you might see some laying on top but as it dries if you're not going anywhere when you wrap it up it'll dry in and it'll look just perfectly fine now I want to get my edges I'm going to do my edges as well they're not really bad but I do want them to be laid down a little bit more I do not do this step every single day because I don't mind it to be a little bit frizzy. Emulsifying it and then I'm just laying it. Laying it down. And if I feel like I need a little something to help it out, then I'll use the toothbrush. I really need a mirror for this. And then I'll just boom, 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 boom. I only go as far as necessary. Laying down those flyaways. A little bit more. And then I'll just do like this. Take my... Now, before bed, I don't use this. I'll just put on my bonnet, and I'll show you that in a minute. But this time, I'm going to use this because I want to set it before leaving the house. And I'll just tie it on. Not too tight. Make sure it's straight. Then I'll take the bonnet. This is the kind of bonnet I have. I have one of these long bonnets for long braids and twists. And I'll put this on until I'm finished getting dressed. This will help the hair lay down, as you guys know. Make sure it's in there flat. And then I'll finish getting dressed and I'll come back and show you what it looks like afterwards. So that you can see how my hair turned out. 
It smells juicy and delicious. <laughs> And that's pretty much it. My favorite time to do this, though, is overnight because then I can put all of my hair tea and all of my other things in there. And even if it, ha if it has a little moisture, it is allowed to dry overnight and it comes out even juicier and even more laid down. But... As a reminder, this was recycled Marley braid hair and I used a little bit of um, finger comber um, hair, twist hair, and Havana twist hair is what it's called. A little bit of that mixed it in, I just used what I had and I've actually used this hair a total of three or four times. So in fact, the Havana twist hair, I bought it back in like when they first came out with it, when they first, first came out with it. So that tells you how long I've had that. Girl. <laughs> yep, but it is laid down and I am prepared and ready to go. Until the next video, live simply and be kind.